of fashion, we love it, and it's a celebration of creativity, and it's just one of many, many ways to express ourselves. Denise Cordero Lipatina of Diva Deluxe is here today to celebrate her fashion flair, and today she's actually also brought us a special guest, and that is Shel Sanchez, and she's here to talk about celebrating women and creativity in 2011 in an event that's organized by the National Hispanic Cultural Center and Creative of Albuquerque. Yes. Nice to have you. Thank you so much. Thanks it's for nice being here. Be here. Happy St. Patrick's Day. I'm sorry my hands are sticky. I think I was from all those lucky charms. We have to pinch each didn't other. We didn't wear green. Us. You are getting some major pinching girlfriends. <laughs> but that's yes. because we're showing outfits that we're going to be auctioning off at Fashion for Field Trips. Yes. Let's talk a little bit about that. First, let's talk about Shell. She is the Director of Education at the Cultural Center. How long have you been doing that? Um, I've been at the National Hispanic Cultural Center for nine and a half years. Wow. That's a while. Hey, so I guess I don't have to ask you if it's been rewarding. It's been wonderful. It's an amazing place to work. It really is. And what you're doing is you're bringing opportunities to a lot of people with fashion, which is so cool because not only do we get to watch the fashion shows and see all the aesthetic value of fashion, but it gives you an opportunity to feel good. And that's exactly what some of these events we're going to be talking about are going to do Absolutely. for the community. Absolutely. So first, let's talk about this project that is going on. Denise, tell us a little bit about it. Uh, fashion for Field Trips is a wonderful project that started um, last year. Mm -hmm. And we decided that what we would do is we, could, we would collect donated clothing okay. from women from all over the city, and then we would resell it. And then we took it a little bit further and we decided to do a fashion show. Okay. So I coordinate all the clothing for the fashion show, put together all the outfits with all these wonderful models from the community at Volunteer. Right. And we have the fashion show on Friday night, March 25th. It starts at 5.30. A week from this Friday. A week from tomorrow. And it's okay. free. So you come in, you get to see all the fashions, but you want to bring your money because at the end of the fashion show, uh -huh. we auction off live auction all of the clothing that you see in the fashion show. And you mentioned you're both wearing outfits that you will be auctioning off? Yes. yes. Absolutely. I'm going to wear the, I'm wearing this brown dress and this is from my own closet and I am going to auction off this brown dress nice. off my body that evening. Okay. And Shell will be donating this red dress and then this That's is a gorgeous. piece that we received from a, a wonderful donor and these are going to be auctioned off. And then we've got a beautiful dress and the mannequin here which is also going to be auctioned off. And so, so that's a perfect example of the fact that just because something is used doesn't mean it doesn't look new and that it's not brand new for somebody else. We have Absolutely. great, great clothing, wonderful quality, mm -hmm. and all of the really great pieces, we're calling it couture pieces, Ooh. will be sold uh, on Friday evening. And then on Saturday, what time is it? Uh, nine, 9 to noon. 9 to noon. 9 a.m. to noon on the sat following will, Saturday. Following, following Saturday, Saturday, we'll sell all the rest of the clothing. There's literally hundreds and hundreds of pieces, and it's all priced between 5 and $20. Okay, this is all at the Hispanic Cultural all Center? All at the Hispanic mm -hmm. Cultural okay. Center. But the best part is at noon, we close for an hour. Okay. And at 1 o'clock, we open back up. And anything that is left, you we give you a bag, and whatever you can put in that bag <gasps> is $5. Oh, that's yeah. amazing. We had that's no great. clothing left Not last thing. year. Not we had, we had hangers dangling on the rolling <laughs> racks. <laughs> and the event is free. I mean, this, this yes. to me, is such a win-win. Yes. yes. Love it. And I always joke, we are not Charlie Sheen, but we are winning. Love and that. The, <laughs> the great part is you have, if you have a budget, you have a great uh, way to get great clothing. Uh-huh. And then the money goes to benefit field trips. And Shell yes. can tell us a little yeah, bit more Shell about that. Yeah, Shell tell us that. about that because that, to me, that's the most rewarding part of this whole scenario. Yeah, absolutely. Um, the the, sh the um, project is called Fashion for Field Trips right. because we're really committed at the Cultural Center to providing free arts opportunities for schools and one of their biggest um, obstacles to going to any arts um, institution is the bus money. Mm. So, you know, they can, uh, you know, all of our performances are free for our school groups, our art workshops during the day are free, but really where we have to raise money is to get kids on a bus. Mm -hmm. And so it takes about $200 um, per bus on okay. average. And so um, through Fashion for Field Trips last year, we raised about $4,000. Oh, We're hoping fantastic. to raise, you know, six to $7,000 this year, and that's a lot of buses. That's a lot of yeah. buses. And so that's a really powerful thing for us. What I think is so great is that, you know, a lot of people don't 
consider that. They think about, oh, well, the event is free or this is a great opportunity. They don't realize you still have to get there. Right. You have to get there somehow. Right. Exactly. And not everybody has a car. Not everybody can afford right. public transportation. And, yeah, and for school groups, you know, they really have to come on chartered buses. You sure. know, they can't. There's rules now where we used to be able to um, take kids in cars, like parents could drive right. kids in cars, that, cars. There's a lot of rules that prohibit that now. Really? So having the bus money is really, really critical for Important. kids and kids that don't have opportunities to go to museums mm. and, you know, meet artists in other situations. So, And that's really what the Hispanic Cultural Center is all about. Exactly. It's really giving them an education through entertainment so right. often. And, yeah. and to have to have so much rich culture and history right here in New Mexico, why not take advantage of it? Yes. Yeah, so we're really excited. And, you know, um, Fashion for Field Trips is part of the larger celebration of women in mm. creativity. Yes. And so we have 35 um, partners in the community led by the Cultural Center and Creative wow. Albuquerque. There's 85 events okay. um, throughout the month 85? of March. 85? 85. We're about, we're about halfway through. So there's still like God, 40 yes. events that you can come to besides um, Fashion for Field Trips. But, okay. Tell so, us some of them. What are some of the... Um, well, tonight there's a poetry reading by nine women poets. So okay. it's called Nine for Five. Each poet reads for five minutes. Okay. Um, there's a photography exhibit by five um, Spanish photographers that have all um, done photographs of women. And that's up at the Education Center at the National Hispanic Club. Cultural Center. Um, there's uh, next week. There's um, vagina monologues, bilingual oh, version. Oh, that's a that's a big, with, amazing um, show. Yeah, and the bilingual version, which you don't get to see except probably in New Mexico. Exactly. With uh, Las Meganenas is producing that. So there's a lot, and um, there's a website, womenandcreativity.org. Yes, and in fact, we're going to put that up on the yeah. screen yeah. right now, so Great. you can find out about all these events that we're talking about and more right there by going to womenandcreativity.org, as Shell said, and that's really going to make it very simple. Now, Denise. Tell us again what you're going to be doing this week. Anything going on this week at Diva Deluxe? Not this week, okay. but um, next week, of course, we have Fashion for Field Trips, right, the fashion show, 5.30 at the National Hispanic Cultural Center in the Education Building. Okay. It's the one with purple on it. Can't miss it. Okay. And then the How next diva. day, yes, <laughs> Saturday from 9 to 12, the uh, recycle sale. Yes. With all the great deals. Okay. Great deals. Um, and then on uh, March 31st, we're having um, an exhibit with an uh, artist, local artist Sarah Anderson, who mm. does beautiful lithographs and oil paintings, and you can come meet the artist and see some of her work. I love this. And um, then last week we had our Videli Trunk Show, yes. which was also part of Women in Creativity, which was had that go. amazing. It was fabulous, wonderful. The Spanish Treasures Collection was uh, the coins, enormous, remember the jewelry? Yes, yes. enormous success. It was. Oh, yes. I'm so glad yeah. to hear that. Yes, yeah. that's something I was curious about, and I'm glad you followed it up because a lot of viewers were really into it. Yes. And yeah. it looked really good. Now, the spring is here, right? Spring the is here. weather is changing. You're going to have to change up some of those wardrobe choices because you're going to have to make them appropriate for the warmer air. Yes. And so therefore, head over to Diva Deluxe. I'm going to be needing to make some changes myself in my wardrobe for the warm weather. Yes, so You'll come by and see us. Yes. <laughs> We've got and tons of new stuff in. Do you? Yes, and we just got shoes in. <gasps> Uh-oh. Except I've already work. bought a pair. So Have you? There's one less. Yes. <laughs> we love shoes, glorious shoes. We can't get enough of shoes. We can see it like with a little Irish thing. Shoes, yes. glorious shoes. And we have shoes. some great lime green shoes, lime green sandals. So you've got to come by. Oh, yeah. Today Fabulous is the day. Shoes. Yes. Today is the day to you buy green some shoes. green, come by and see I us. love that. Yes. Well, I want to thank Shell so much for being with us today. Thank I think you. it's wonderful what you're doing. And I think it's great that you were able to get the message out to all of our yeah, viewers today. Yeah, I appreciate the time. Thank you so much. Thank you. And Denise, Yay. as always, we love having you. My pleasure. You, and we love the value you offer to all of our fashion loving divas out there. We appreciate that. And I will be heading to that store. And you can Come also see. check out the What oh, in the what is that? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, if you're just waking up, this is gonna get down to bed pretty fast.